constant frequent regions because it's sad that they don't tell you and these mechanics are just robbing people left and right on things that aren't getting resolved they're not fixing your uh, extreme soot levels in your particulate filters never-ending problem for this truck constant frequent regions uh, spent over twenty thousand dollars at one company and uh, five thousand four thousand several times this can be a very expensive problem and I finally learned something here today spend 500 bucks buy you one of these Ansel it's called an Ansel HD 3400 and within this computer you can run a, a regen process if, if for some reason your light is kicked on and and the button over here on the dash the regen button right here doesn't allow you to go into region and you got a red stop on the dash and you have this system uh, you can do a you can force a regen on this truck with this system so right here uh, when you go into the diagnostic mode the Cummings so you'll come back let me bring you back to the beginning I'm gonna exit here okay so basically you're gonna click on the Cummings and there's a bunch of different options here and you go to the debugging line click on that it's gonna initialize I've got to turn the key on or it won't tell me any information so that's my fault there um, so I'll initialize it we'll come in here and then it'll give you this you hit confirm and basically you can read your fault codes here you can erase your fault codes read the data stream uh, the exhaust reset you click on that right there hit confirm give it a second to catch up and it's going to give you this and basically you're going to have the the filter regeneration uh, all of that's but we're going to do the after treatment maintenance we're going to click confirm here and then you come down click on confirm and right here you hit a dead end I didn't see the drop down for a long time but here you just click here the drop down and you just go to all reset once you uh, reset that right there or you can just reset the diesel particulate filter here. Once you reset it, all reset, that red stop light will come off of your dash. Your horn should sound if you have the system like we do. This is a 2015 Freightliner. The horn will sound, and the horn sounding on this truck is an indication that it needs to go into regen. So now that the red stop light's off, you don't have to spend 20,000, 10,000. Uh, you can actually just uh, reset it and let it do a regen and then I suggest after the full regen is done Go ahead and fire the truck back up and run the codes and see if you can figure anything else out about your motor But that's the secret guys uh, get you one of these Ansel's they're like five maybe six hundred bucks the make sure you get the HT uh, 3400 and that should allow you to do all of the uh, maintenance you need on your own trucks And you don't have to spend 20 and 5 and 10,000 we spent um over probably 40 or 50 thousand dollars on this truck at mechanics because this constant frequent regen problem we have we send it to a mechanic they have a better machine it's always to have a better machine they don't tell you you can get this machine for a couple hundred bucks and you can do everything you need with this from everything I've seen so far I can't reprogram it or anything but but you can you can do live stream everything so that's how you force a regen if this helped you maybe it even saves you a little bit of money please just uh, show the love and uh, help me out by hitting the like button that's all I need Maybe even a subscription that would help too to get this video out to more people because it's sad that they don't tell you and these mechanics are just robbing people left and right on things that aren't getting resolved. They're not fixing your uh, extreme soot levels in your particulate filters. They're just, they're cleaning them, but it, it, it's building back up and your computer doesn't let you do a, a, a soot clean out or a, a regen. It's, it's, a, a, it's a scam. I appreciate y'all. Thanks. Peace.